Okay, very rude. Uh, poor, poor, poor emote. <sighs> funny shit. Sometimes, sometimes you're annoying. Sometimes you're funny. It's good. <gasps> right, sister. I think we are done here. I am pressing your hard work. Yeah, that's right. You should be ashamed of yourself. Not shame. Shame, shame. Right, let's go. <laughs> hard work. Been like. I can't remember. Probably one to two hours on each emote. Damn. That's a lot of time. Very much pleased when you said it. Said what? Your feet thick? No, thank you. That? Say what? Mm, now that you ask me to say it again, I probably won't say it. <laughs> One in a lifetime thing, even though I don't know what is it. You can watch the VOD again if you want to hear it, but that's it. <laughs> oh, you... ah, I like this one. This one's funnier. This crying one. Because it really looks sad. <laughs> ah. I watched a video done by a dentist and then they were taking out one of like the cracked teeth so the teeth is like cracked they were like taking out that cracked part and they say it's because of biting eyes or like if you're opening a packet but biting eyes is so good dude I'm gonna play WWE uh, 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 uh. E, of course. WWE. Damn. If only, right? If so, if they offered me a contract for WWE and I'll get paid, well, contract and get paid, I I would probably take it. <laughs> I know earlier I said I don't want to get injured, but if I had if I had it for a job, I'd probably take it. <laughs> Ash, of course. <laughs> what will be your name? I don't know. Bloody Devil of Doom. <laughs> I will play against Sensei. Sure. I'll make sure to break your face in. Your nose, right? The one where the handphone keep hitting? I'll make sure I break your nose. <laughs> I'm going to get banned. <laughs> banned for threatening people. Uh, your nose is now... Your nose is now... Bends to one side, right? I'll make sure I break it into one side. And make it lower. Make it short. Do stand-up comedy in my wheelchair. Oh no! That pun! Why? <laughs> We are good. Whoever that laughed at that is going to hell. And I laughed at it, so I'm going to hell. <laughs> I'll make sure my nose gets broken and then you'll be like, Oh, it feels good, my nose. <laughs> then you'll be like that. <laughs> yeah, if, if there was such an offer, right, to do like martial arts for a living, I think I'll probably take it. But I need to like, get fit. Probably should have saved over that file, but it's okay. Over there. I can smell more. <laughs> you need extra hole. <laughs> the normal people have like two nostrils. You need to have 
<laughs> if you do more, you should do... I mean, probably you cannot, right? I mean, you, maybe you can. Do nose piercing. And then you got like extra two holes at the side. Nose piercing stream? <laughs> Punch it in my head. Yep. Your nose is gonna be short. Like half the normal length. Gonna look so cute with your little short nose. No, oh, I see the treasure there. The new style for you. More small but strong. Now nah, probably not very strong now because I don't do much exercise anymore. But last time, last time I was strong. Now probably, now probably it's a no go, man. Weak. But I guess if I if I train, then yeah, I think I could get back pretty quickly. But. Well, it's not my job, so... <laughs> Probably not gonna take up martial arts anytime soon. I wanna... <clears throat> I wanna do like Muay Thai or kickboxing. But I don't wanna get injured. So that's not gonna work. Karate Kid. I like that movie. Karate Kid is a, a pretty good movie. I didn't... Is there a second one? I only watched the first one. It's a good movie. And Taekwondo Kid. I did Taekwondo for 8 years. But it's been more than 8 years since I stopped. It was fun. I liked it a lot. I like the sparring. You fight one by... Uh, one... Uh, you fight people in the ring. Those were the best. Oh, I see Gundam. The first one is the best. I didn't watch the second one because the first one is good. Usually that's the thing with like sequels, right? The second one usually is not as good as the first one. So I usually just stick to like the first one. Even with like anime, if like I watch one episode of the second season and I don't like it, I usually just drop it. Am I commonly going to be named finally stand for something? <laughs> I'm sure if you do decide to be a comedian, you're gonna be alright. <laughs> you're going to be. Oh man. One small step for mankind, one giant leap for Bob, eh, for Joe. Joe, Bob, yeah. <laughs> Find back on my feet. Uh... <laughs> That's great. 10 out of 10 would go, would go to watch your show. Mm, I like ice. Not the drug ice, but actual ice. Me too. We'll go with Sensei. Yeah, we'll go and watch those stand up comedy. Gonna be great. Naga will sponsor the trip. ASMR. Ice eating ASMR. And when my teeth spoil, Naga, Naga will sponsor new teeth. Ah, yeah. Of course you'll support. <laughs> Wouldn't miss it for the world. Oh, it's so cold tonight. I think it's the drink. The drink is cold. I have no idea who's Sully. Who is Sully? 
Theater. Damn, so many names, so many characters, I don't remember. Baby, you want my name? Uh, you pay, and then you can have your name. You pay, you are the sponsor. Hmm. Well, if you're not gonna pay, I guess we, only, we can only afford to watch virtually. Your sensei is broke. Sensei got no money. So sad. You see? No money. That's why my, my PC is still a potato. No. <laughs> nope. Where? Give me. There's no money from streaming. <laughs> Can be my physical therapist. Aww. <laughs> uh, uh, aww. Sure. Sure. <laughs> but we're too far away. We're too far. What's to do? Is it? Yeah, the intel. Going to be used for the trip. You will do the therapy. No, you're gonna make him worse. <laughs> no money. Oh gosh. You need to sponsor me for the trip and then the money I earn from here I'll put in the bank. For interest. <laughs> oh, much trust. Do you really trust Naga to do your therapy? He you he, he'll probably be you'll be a good assistant because you're tall, right? You're tall and you work out. Do you be able to help lift people and stuff? Toss them, throw to the right and left. <laughs> Great physician. You're, you're not no, you're not an unlicensed physician. That's illegal. Illegal physician. Police, hello. We have illegal practice here. Oh. oh, it's this guy again. Ah, get comfy. Lean back a little bit. Oh, man. Good. You are law, law can never be. Mm. I would like to see you tell that to the police when they catch you. <laughs> Maybe in your country you can get away with it, but I'm not sure if you go to other countries and you're like, I'm a physician, and they're like, where's your documents? You're like, I don't have documents, I am the law. I don't think they're gonna be like, okay, I guess we'll let you go. Oh gosh. Okay, you're free to go. Did we come from like, oh yeah, we did come from Cathedral. Oh. Residential District. Here, you could probably get away with most of it if you had a little bit of money. <laughs> Not sure about other countries though. The corrupt countries, yeah. If you had money, you can get away with most of the stuff. No, not all the countries. If you do that in like Australia, New Zealand and all that, not gonna not gonna be so easy, but if the more corrupt countries you could get away with a little bit of money, yeah. But not all the countries have such corrupted police. There will be corruption obviously, but 
you know? Not all, not all of the countries. No police and army never cooperate. Well, for us here, it's like you don't see much of the army people anyway. It's mostly the police. So, that's all there is to it. Don't do business with friends, yes or no. Uh, for me, it, if like close friends, maybe. Right? I prefer not to because it can get complicated. And then when things go bad, it's gonna be bad. But if with my very close friends, it's maybe, maybe. But if it's just like, you know, not like super close friends, but just like acquaintances, probably not. I've, I know friends who work with other friends and have got screwed over and I'm like, ugh. So, maybe with like very close friends, even if I end up having like a loss, I'll be like, eh, it's okay, maybe. Maybe. But you see, that's why I'm doing solo work, right? Because I don't like working with people. <laughs> I like I like doing things my way. And when I work with, when I'm, like even in like a group situation, I'm usually the one leading or helping to make decisions. I'm not the follower kind, so that's why I prefer working on my own. <laughs> I can work in a group setting, but then if somebody is like making a very bad decision, I'm like, that's a shit decision, what the shit are you saying? You know, that kind of thing. So I think in... In Asian culture, usually they'll be like, the older people is right and all that, you should listen to them. But sometimes I'm like, that's a bad decision. That doesn't make sense. Why? Why are you doing it? I like to ask why. And I feel like that's what everybody should be asking. Like, if someone wants to do this and it's like, it's a little sus, you'll be just asking like, why are you doing it this way? Or why not this way, you know? Internet never give trouble, that's true. My home internet is like, good so talented some people are just <laughs> ridiculous like if i say something and then like someone don't like it and they ask me why that's good you know so it shows that they are listening but some people are just like oh okay 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 i'm like all right good i get it my way <laughs> the win-win either way I think I'm quite flexible, but I do want things done like a certain way, so like a certain quality and all that. It, yeah. Get it done quick, but it has to have like standards. Some people are just like, eh, just whatever, and I'm like, mm. nope. Flexible. Yeah, so like if you're asking me to stream Genshin, I'll be like, no, because the quality will be shit. That's why I'm only doing it on Discord. But for Twitch, nah, there's no way. It's gonna be so shit quality. Like the quality right now is so so, it's not the best. But if I have to stream Genshin, it's gonna be more shit. Agree to disagree. Hope that's your opinion. And this is my opinion about myself, so that's fine either way. The most important thing is to get shit done. Uh that get shit done quick. But also having some Ended some quality, not just do it for the sh sake of doing it. Yeah, not a lot of people can can not a lot of people cannot agree. I mean, like, sure. I mean, it's your opinion, right? <laughs> uh, I mean, that's fine. It doesn't really matter to me, because <laughs> whether it's a good thing or a bad thing, I'm still gonna do my thing unless you give me like a justification of, oh, you're doing this wrong. You should do it like this and why. And maybe I'll take it into consideration, but but sometimes if you're like that joke is not funny, I'll be like, all right, if it's not funny to you, it's it's fine, it's funny to me, that kind of thing. So it's it's okay. The thing is simple. What thing is simple? It's fine. People will agree or disagree and all that, and it's okay if you want if you like to do things 
like a certain way you know like how for asians we don't walk in the house with shoes but if i go to like a western country and they ask me to walk in the house with shoes i will do it because you know it's it's when at rome you do as rome romans do or whatever <laughs> if you like it go for it if you, yeah I agree with Sensei all the time. No, you don't. <laughs> we don't agree all the time. <laughs> it's whatever. Like, op mm, opinions are opinions, but also it de depends on what topic. That's all. You. <laughs> uh, you increase my blood pressure. <laughs> One day, if I get struck, it'll probably be from you. <laughs> some people be denying facts. Yeah, that's why I said some things, right? Some things, it's like okay to agree to disagree, but there are certain topics where it's like when you know, like the thing is like completely wrong. It's like there's nothing to discuss. That's just facts. But a lot of the things, like I, if let's say I like this game and you say this game is shit, I'll be like, okay, that's fine too. <laughs> I mean, that's your opinion. Uh, I thought you were capable of increasing blood sugar in my suit. <laughs> uh, uh, opposite effect. <laughs> Increased blood pressure. <laughs> Uh, there is no sweetness. There is only bitterness and salt. Lots of salt. Must be someone else. Um. Yeah, Super Robot War got me back into playing games. Oh, that's good. Nice. Never played that before. Ugh. Not big into the robot games, but this game has a little bit of robot stuff. Oh, look at her. Mm. Good. I mean, that's progress, right? So that's good. It'll make you feel more motivated to keep pushing on. That's the beauty of games. <laughs> I keep saying I want to check my blood pressure, but I keep forgetting. Should probably check blood pressure and blood sugar. I'm sure it'll be fine. When 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 relaxing is like 120, 60. When talking to Naga, 200 over over 150. <laughs> Make sure you have your business. Uh, I've got the... What do you call it? The stuff at home. The auto blood pressure thing and also the thing to measure BP. We've got that at home. So probably... I, I won't go to like the hospital to get it checked because now is not really a good time to go to hospitals. Because government hospitals, very full. Okay, because of COVID and all that. Private hospital, expensive. So I'll just test it on my own at home. Do I take vitamin D? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure you've got to take quite a few. But that's okay. Vitamin D. And I take vitamin C every day too. Or at least when I remember. I take vitamin C. Because I don't really like to eat fruits. So I've got to take... A little extra like those are okay vitamins the calcium and all that mm. well, just a little extra help from the pills are okay uh, the only thing that i don't really take are like painkillers i guess even if i'm very sick i try to push through a little bit oh I eat a large portion of cake. Oh, oh. And, the, and I feel full. That's good. What cake? I like cake. Hmm. 
強ですがうまくいきましたね。Delicious, delicious cake。これでしばらくは外に一切声は漏れませんよ。さて、たっぷり話を聞かせてもらおうじゃねえか。ああ。で、そんな言い方したら、こっちの悪者もどうでしょう。エリオット、ほどほどにね。Are you eating okay? Yeah, I think it's because with time the muscle will kind of shrink because you can't use it as much as you used to. So that's why I guess you're getting smaller. But it's okay, one step at a time, you know? So you start being able to play games and then you just. A little bit of movement here and there would count. Choco Ice, Dark Forest. Oh, so decadent. Much richness. Oh man, when you eat like chocolate stuff, it feels very sinful because it's so good. Wow. But yeah, but usually when I order cake, um, because chocolate is usually quite um, sweet, right? Even though dark chocolate is not as sweet, but usually the cakes here can get a bit sweet. We'd go for like more fruity cakes because that's what my mom likes. Fruity cakes or like tiramisu. Tiramisu can get kind of sweet too, so it depends on which shop. So good, delicious. It's an island cake? I've never heard of an island cake before. Is that like a few flavors or is that choco ice duck forest called an island cake? Is it as big as an island? The last time I had cake was like, what do you call it? Crepe cake. One with like many layers. Ah, so good. It's decorated as island. Oh. Recipe come from islands, maybe. <laughs> oh, that sounds good. Delicious. Is that the cake for your cousin? It's a very mature cake for a birthday cake. <laughs> Thought like kids like you know, like those cartoon kind of cakes. Cake in the side like volcano and hot chocolate around it. Wow, <laughs> that sounds like a very OP cake. What? <laughs> Oh. Yum yum yum. You wanted a small cake. That does not sound like a small cake. What? <laughs> Walted chocolate. Very good. Mm -mm -mm. That does not sound like a small cake. Uh. The cake is the size of a child. Got a small vanilla cake for her. Wait, what? <laughs> oh. More. Well, oh. she's a smart girl then. Then she's like, more cakes are better than one big cake because I feel like many different cakes, you get different taste and flavors. If you have one of the same cake, the last time you guys eat cereal, probably like years. We don't really eat cereal here. I usually, well, before a COVID, or before like the lock, not lockdown, before the movement control happened, we still went out to like hawker center for breakfast. So breakfast would be like noodles or coffee, noodles, coffee, mostly noodles, yeah. <laughs> You can have fried rice for noodles. There are people selling fried rice already early in the morning. For me? Hmm. I don't know. Probably a long time ago. Don't really eat cereals here. It's been a long, long time. We've got Coco Crunch, which is like a bit more chocolatey. Coco Crunch, 
um, conflicts. Hmm. Hey, how did she get here? <laughs> Mostly those two. Coco Crunch with Coco Crunch is a bit chocolatey, so I have it with milk. It's really good. Conflicts, conflicts, all right. A bit of a healthier alternative. Maggie is a cereal. Sounds good. Ah, uh, Maggie. Instant noodles are the best. Ah, uh, I want to have my spicy samyang noodle. Probably to mm, probably tomorrow or Sunday I'll have it. Yum yum yum. Honey nut Cheerio. Mm -hmm. Fancy. Yeah, fast and furious. That's how we need. That's how we need food to be. Mm -mm -mm. With this samyang noodles, just with like one egg. Oh, it's so good. Some people make it really fancy. They eat with like cheese and stuff like that. But I, I, I don't want to add cheese to my spicy noodles because when you eat, yeah, ra ramen noodles, the the Korean one, the samyang, the very spicy one. Because if you add cheese, it will make the sauce not as spicy. Yes. It's not just them, I guess everybody likes it. We have a lot of ramen here too. But the ramen is a bit salty here, but you can always ask them to add more uh, soup. I'm sure everybody likes ramen, not just them. Yum yum yum. But near, near my place, there's a really good ramen place, but their ramen is good, but their chicken is really good. <laughs> their fried chicken, mmm. Crispy on the outside, juicy on the inside. It's really, really good. Yum, yum, yum. Delicious, delicious. Ah, uh, I wonder if they're still open amidst like the COVID and all that. Because a lot of shops are kind of closing down because lack of business and all that. Oh, here. We are looking for you. Aww. Don't say it. Say what? Yeah. I'm sure it's like a very... It's, it's like, it's coming up, right? Because like if you ask like 10, 20 years ago, most people don't know much about like Japanese food. And then Japanese food became quite popular. And then Korean food is like a little later, at least for here. Here, Korean food came... became a bit more popular maybe in like the last 10 years or so. Wait, wait, at first you went to eat Korean food, it was like, huh? What are all these side dishes? But now it's like, hmm. Good stuff, the stew and all that. Yum, yum, yum. Unwait. Maybe I should check out the... Mm, kind of lazy to go and take away food as well. Very cheap. Oh, here is not that cheap. Because here, a lot of the hawker foods are very cheap. So let's say, um, on average, hawker food, let's say one bowl of noodles of whatever, prawn noodles and stuff like that, it's like five Malaysian ringgit. So it's like, uh, let's say a little bit over one USD. So very cheap, right? And then if you go eat ramen, ramen would be like, three to four times the price maybe five times the price so here is quite expensive because it's like restaurant food right 
compared to like hawker food because hawker food here is like cheap and good then ramen would be considered more of like restaurant quality even like korean food you have to go to like a cafe or like a restaurant to eat so those are a bit pricey in comparison feel good once in a while you can treat yourself good stuff Have you ate Ko Kobe beef? I, um, mm, I've had wa wagyu 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 before. Ko Kobe beef, Kobe beef. I don't think so. But wagyu was like super good. Mm -mm -mm. Like, it's. I feel like personally, it's not worth it to go to a shop and eat. We. We went once and it was good, but it was expensive. So what we'll do is that we'll go to like the butcher and buy the meat and then you just cook it on your own because steak is actually quite simple to cook. So you just just plain salt, pepper, that's all you need. Uh, medium rare to rare, perfect, that's all you need. But shops are so expensive, but it's, it's a good experience, but it's not for me, you know, like the fine dining, uh... I went, I went like once for an actual fine dining experience and after finishing the food, I was hungry. <laughs> so we went to like a mamak store, so mamak store is like, uh... You can get like curry and all that, we had that for dinner, supper, after the fine dining experience. First than last time. You need to feel your belly. Delicious. Yeah, <laughs> feel different kind of feel, but yeah, that that works too. Like you feel whether it's full and you're like, mm, not yet, so you feel it some more. Korean barbecue, mm, Korean barbecue is good. Like nearby here, there's no all you can eat. There used to be, but that shop closed down. So very sad. Maybe it closed down after I went there. <laughs> Near my house, there used to be a all you can eat. Uh, it's kind of like. Seafood, barbecue. Is it barbecue only? Yeah, I think it's only barbecue. I ate so many crabs. <laughs> and now it's not now it's not all you can eat. <laughs> oh gosh. It was so good. Mmm, had so many crabs. I got like, like a pro professional crab peeler. Oh, so good. Eat and survive 70 years without a single problem. Yeah, that's the plan. <laughs> that's the plan. You live longer, you get to eat more. That's my plan. I plan to eat all the chickens. They will not they will not be able to escape their fate. <laughs> Happy life. That's right. Gonna be a long 70 years. Did that work? Cheers to 70 years. It's gonna be a long 70 years. What that guy's do. Do you fast sometimes? Nope. Nope. Never. I have uh, my aunts and my bro- eh, no, not fasting. They just go vegetarian for certain prayers, but no. No fasting. <laughs> but she doesn't, you're right. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I can't, man. 
even if I have like a very light lunch, if I have just salad for lunch, oh, there's no way. My hands will be shivering, my feet, my leg will be shivering when I drive. So no, there's, there's no way I can do fasting. <laughs> Are they talking at the same time? There's, there's no way I can survive not eating. Oh. Salutes to those people who do fast because there's no way. Like even here, if you pray to like uh, Guan Yin, you're not supposed to eat beef. I still eat beef. Sometimes I do prayers too. But I'm sure it'll be okay. <laughs> That's a good neck crack, eh? Did it a couple of times, that's good. Alludes to you, you could never... Mm, I'll be too hungry. Meat food! Gosh dang it. A good cleanse. <laughs> My body's like more food. Give me more. Or more more. Food, food is my life, man. Unless, well, touch wood, but unless I need it for like medical purpose, I don't think I'm gonna stop. I don't think I can. Because I'm out very often for work and all that. And if I don't eat, I don't have the energy to do my work. Can feel the difference you have more than anything I see. I don't think I can, because I need energy to you know move people and all that exercise and uh, it's very physical gosh dang it there we go I used to have take like what those tea that will cleanse. Don't feel slug no. For me, I feel weak. Like I've I've had salad. If it's even if it's just salad, my legs feel wobbly, and it's very dangerous when you're driving. So probably not the best. <sighs> well, probably don't want that. <laughs> But it's a good cleanse, I think. Just not now. Not not now. <laughs> I think if I don't have work and all that. Even if I don't have work, I don't think I'll do fasting. The most I'll do is maybe drink the tea to like cleanse your inside and then shit. But yeah, that's it. <laughs> don't need it. Yeah. For the time being, yeah. <laughs> Probably not. I heard it's a good cleanse, but I don't want to. That's the most important thing. I don't want to. <laughs> okay. Alright. Go. Go, Rin, go. Oh, 
Ah, good old Rin. Alright, let's go. Team is shaping up a bit. Oh no. No! Why you heal? not date yet. Ah. There we go. More coffee. Instant coffee. What do I get over there? Oh, do I need to change to Altina again? Does this not work? I didn't see that little. Haha, uh -huh, too small. I didn't see that. Change back. Into. Very crowded spot. Go here first. Hello, Mushi Mushi. Anybody here? Surprisingly, no monsters over here. Go. Oh. Very claustrophobic. Luckily, I'm not very claustrophobic at all. Ooh, open space, Ami. You're going to work, yeah. <laughs> Got extra work. Ah, <sighs> but it's okay. This uh, usually the Saturday client, Saturday and Sunday, I'm usually off. It's just that one is like a re uh, extra from like. The weekday and then one more is like uh, an on and off client so when she feels pain then she'll call me so yeah just too uh, just too but it's okay it shouldn't take too long oops it'll be like a bit over one hour each ah uh, it's okay Gotta work hard. Oh, we may be going into lockdown. Maybe. Uh, I think they're having a meeting. Like maybe they already had the meeting. I'm not sure if there's any announcement because I'm streaming now. But yeah, if there is a full lockdown, I should make some money before then. <laughs> Can don't make money, can. Just stay at home, you make zero money. 
just play maple all day, yeah? That will be the life. Need money. <laughs> uh, that would be good. I wish. I wish I could just stay home and play games all day. But, but I cannot. Need money. Yeah, so not very rich. He spent a lot of money in Maple. <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> rich boy. He top up for Maple just for the looks. I'm poor boy. <sighs> poor boy playing, playing maple. Poor boy but then can still top up for maple. <laughs> he helped maple story be rich. He maintained the server, you know? Don't top up for maple. Hmm. Me too. I'm free to play. And me, I use I I earn meso and I buy maple points. Liar! <laughs> you still have dreams? I, I assume you're like you're like saying like oh dreams like in the future what I wanna do. I just want a simple life. I just need a good amount of money that can help me maintain my retired life. That's it. Oh yeah, same. My dream is to retire ASAP. That's same too. That's, al that's along the same line. Like I want to earn some money now. Maybe put a little bit in like, uh, how do you call it? The bank fixed deposit, a bit of investment, and then I want to retire by, I don't know, probably, hopefully before 60. When you're sleepy, oh. <laughs> that took a turn. Um, if that's not sarcasm, but... Uh, dreams? Not really. Very rarely will I have realistic dreams. Most of the time, it's just black, right? But when I do have dreams, it starts off very realistic. And then sometimes I'm like confused, like, huh? Is this real life? Then after that, something weird will happen and I'll be like, ah, it's a dream. God damn it. <laughs> Any spend on food, don't like traveling, clothing and stuff. Ah, hmm, I save a, a little bit, but I also feel like I want to spend some of the money that I earn, because who knows what will happen. But yeah. That's why traveling and all that is fun. Pretty sure everybody here have goals. Hmm, here and there, for sure. <laughs> But I think like compared to when I was younger, the goals are much simpler now. Mm. Yeah. Traveling traveling is fun. Going with like close friends, uh, it's good. Family is great too. Yeah, it's just like for a change of pace. But yeah, I think most of the time I spend money on like food too. <laughs> food is one thing I don't mind spending money on. Clothing, yeah, clothing I don't... M most of my clothes, my parents just buy for me from like the night market or the sales. I'm not very picky with what I wear. As long as it's comfortable, I'm okay. No cast time.
I'm gonna need a break from your family. That's what the trips are for. <laughs> but yeah. But you know, for me, I, I wanna spend as much time as I can with my parents. So. Bachelorette, yes. It's a weird way of saying are you single, but yes. <laughs> Single and happy. Ooh, what do? Mm. Where's the broken guy oh, back there? Yeah, same. I do enjoy single life. <laughs> At first, when, when you know, when you yes, you start off single, it's like oh, I feel so lonely. But now it's like, mm. the thought of being in a relationship, I'm like, oh, because I hate. <laughs> I'm very bad at replying messages. I also don't really like replying to messages. But you know, I I try. But I read the messages, but sometimes I'm like, ah, it's not that important. Do I have to reply? So that's like, it's a bit of that. <laughs> but yeah, I like I like that freedom of doing things my own way and my own pace, more like it. You know? Like if I wanna eat, eat fast, eat slow. Yeah. <laughs> I read most of the messages. Sometimes it takes a while to reply because I'm like, it's not an important message. <laughs> if it's not work related, I'll take my time replying. <laughs> that's, that's the truth. <laughs> that's just how it is. If it's work stuff, yeah, I think I reply. I, You know, you get, it pops up in the notification and I see, I'm like, okay, it's work, money. Like sometimes when I see the notification, I'm like, oh, Naga is asking what I ate for lunch, I'll reply later. <laughs> <laughs> so don't worry, I see the messages. No, I have to wait one week for you to reply. <laughs> That's the true friendship, okay? True friendship. Even my friends as well. Like, I'll reply like the next day and I'll just tell them, oh, sorry, um, different time zone. But sometimes it's just <laughs> you get it <laughs> sometimes it's like you know like you see <laughs> if you ask me like oh i need help in genshin you see i reply quite fast but if it's not then it's like ah it'll be okay it's not emergency in your opinion relationship how many days can you go without talking to your partner probably i need to talk every day <laughs> but it's not like talk talk on the phone it's just like checking up on them like oh are you okay Part partner is different than friends partner probably an everyday thing yeah even if it's just to check in like oh good morning and then after a while like oh what are you doing but i don't expect them to like reply fast all these talks be cringy you are cringe <laughs> but yeah for friends, it's like, eh, I can reply tomorrow. But for relationship, it's like, different standard. They can reply late a few hours, I don't mind. But, you know, at least let me know you're still alive. Because if that's the way, if that's the way, then we are, we are not in a relationship because I don't message my friends so much. They're clingy. I, I think I'm a little bit clingy when it comes to relationship. But that's how relationships are. Because if I don't message them for for days, then are we really in a relationship? <laughs> then we might as well just be friends. Because that's how I message my friends too. <laughs> that damage? Yeah, that was damage. That is a different different standard, I feel. But of course, if they say like, oh, I'm busy with stuff. But I feel like if you can't be that busy, right? Unless something big happens and like maybe something in the family, some big emergency, then yeah, I understand. But besides that, 
How busy can you be to not contact your partner? I don't think I can be with someone like that, but if... If they are, yeah, if you are that kind of person and if you are in a relationship with someone that don't mind it, then good for you. But for me, nah, not for me. <laughs> I got cast that guy didn't talk in three days. Did you give a reason? Was it like a... I don't know. That's your relationship stuff, but... I'd get mad too if the person was like... If the person told me like, okay, I need like a, you know... I don't know. I'm a space person. Yeah, so you probably need to find someone who who's like that as well. Because for me, if someone don't give me like a good reason, I'd be like, then why are we even together then? <laughs> yeah, the, the most important thing is finding someone who clicks with you. He is like that. <laughs> but you're not in a relationship with B, so it's different. Sensei, why? <laughs> Relationships are... I, it's like a different... Different from like friendship. <laughs> I'm saying like in terms of like messaging and all that. That's all. <laughs> so yeah, you have to find someone who clicks with you. So if you're like a space person, you need to find someone who's like, Yeah, I'm chill with that space too. If you're clingy, you need to find someone who is who is okay or who who appreciates your clinginess. It's all about just matching. Have you had friends jealous of your other friends? Friends or relationship? Friends jealous of friends. Friends jealous of friends. Hmm. I've been jealous of like partners, friends, but it's not like some were pretty bad, but most of them were like okay. Uh, friend means have you had friends jealous of your other friends? So like me jealous of my friend or jealous of my friend's friend because I don't care about my friend's friend so that one no jealous of my friend not really no <laughs> either one no <laughs> mm, maybe like maybe if it's like a small thing I don't know like if they won a lottery yeah maybe I'll be a little bit jealous but I'll be like eh, good for you I'm jealous that my yeah <laughs> yeah that's the same right like if they won a lottery uh but if they're already rich it's kind of like uh, it's fine good for you so not not really maybe just like a small bit depending on what it is but not so much This house is big until Wi-Fi cannot cover the whole house. First world problems. Ah, the first world problem. I need a few extend extenders. Is it called extender? To extend the Wi-Fi in my house. Ah, the struggle. <laughs> uh.